Potentially, this might be one of those passing of the torches type of games here on Pac-12 Network on Saturday, 2 p.m. Pacific time. I say the passing of the torch because right now, Jared Goff, you can make yeah. the case, is the best quarterback in the country. Jake Browning, the quarterback, the true freshman for UW, you guys are both impressed by his play. Is he where Jared Goff is now? Absolutely not. Could he be? Potentially, but nonetheless, this is a Bears team. Both of these squads coming off wins. But the Bears, this was a yeah. stunning win <laughs> against Texas. They got to handle sort of being the, the hunted, so to speak, which is kind of weird to me. <laughs> they, uh, you know, they've been kind of under the radar because they haven't won really in the last few years. No one knows who Jared Goff is. Now they do. That was a statement game this past Saturday against Texas on national television. And I know they won because of a fluke extra point, you know, but that was a great win for this program. And like I said, the whole country knows about this Cal Bear team, and they put themselves in contention and to be a contender in the Pac-12 North. My biggest concern is still this defense. They gave up over 500 yards to Texas quarterback Gerard Hurd. He lit that defense up. Now they have to go up to Husky Stadium up there. It's a tough place to play. Jake Browning, uh, Jake Browning, Sue, and this offense is rolling. It's a tough, tough matchup for this team. Yeah, and I, Matt, I remember you a couple of weeks ago telling me, Sue, yeah. you got to watch he's this guy. Deal, he's man. the real yeah. deal, and he's definitely the real deal. You know, I go back to the first game. His first game out, you have to understand, coach is going to probably hold him back. He's a freshman. But this guy has gotten better and better every week, and you hit it right on the nose. It's not going to be an easy win. And I actually had Cal at the beginning of the season going in and beating Washington because of the quarterback position. I'm not so sure <laughs> now the, the way Jake Brett, too, the the defense defense is defense Absolutely. So this is a different football team than I saw. We knew the defense would kind of find themselves, but this early, Jake Browning playing the way he's playing, getting better and better, it's going to be a good football game. Quickly week. here, you sold on the Bears defense? No. Okay. <laughs> they had two weeks they played they well, and then yeah, obviously but they didn't not play against anybody Texas. in the yeah. first two weeks. Yeah. You know, Texas lit them up, and Texas offense is not necessarily a, a, a powerhouse yes. offense. Nearly 600 yards of total offense for that oh, Longhorns yeah. team. Uh, Sonny Dykes, I'm sure, and Art Kaufman, who is the defensive coordinator of the Bears, would love to see that total go way down oh, on yes. Saturday. You can catch a Cal and UW 2 p.m. Pacific here on Pac-12 Network. And for everything that's happening around the landscape of the Pac-12 Conference, all you have to do is follow us on Twitter at Pac-12 Networks.